Hey guys, happy Friday. So right now I'm on my way actually to the mall. Gotta get these nails done. My nails look terrible. They were so cute when I first got them. I got these for the for the DR. They're like these, you know, I was feeling kind of festive, so I did this. But I think it's time to go back plain, maybe nude. So today I'm getting ready for um, the BT experience. I'm actually gonna be there on Saturday, the 23rd of June. I'm gonna be with AT&T, super excited. So I figured I'd vlog to kind of show you guys how I prep for that. Um, this is my second time at the BT experience with my first time with AT&T, so yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. So yeah, so today I'm just gonna go to the mall, like I said, to go get uh, my nails done. I actually took a poll on Instagram because I'm trying to figure out what the heck I'm gonna wear. You guys, my closet is atrocious. So anytime I have to look for something to wear, I kind of get low-key anxiety because it's crazy. I need to get, I need to clean my closet. I just have not had the time to do so. And since I haven't had the time to clean my closet, I usually just go pick up something from the store, the mall real quick to wear, just so I don't have to go through all of that. But I actually picked out a few outfits that I had you guys um, vote for. So if you guys take the poll, you guys can let me know what outfit I should wear for tomorrow. And that's the one I'm going to pick. My makeup is pretty like basic, simple, but very cute and glowy. I tried some new makeup products today and I will have to say I am here for it. Every time I have something to do, I'll try like a new makeup to see if I want to experience it or wear it for like a special event or something. I think I might have to do this one. It's the Too Faced Born This Way Full Coverage Concealer and I use it as a full face foundation. And y'all, she is looking pretty. So let me hurry up. I have to get Kai ready and then we are going to head over to the mall. I'm going to actually go look and see if I can find something cute to wear, like something outside of what I already have. Uh, but yeah, that's on the agenda today. So nails are done. This is what I did. I decided to do nude, but like not so basic. You know I can still see you, right? So right now I'm headed into Barnes and Noble because there's a magazine that I'm so excited. I'll share with you guys why I'm so excited, but let's go pick up that magazine. All right, just picked up the magazines. And now we're gonna head over to Brio. You wanna go eat at Brio? Fishies. Fishies. She's always asking for seafood, but doesn't really, I don't think she really gets that it's seafood. This person watching. Let's go to Brio's. Okay, I just pulled up. I'm in my car right now trying to upload something, but like there's no service. I'm in like a parking garage and there's like no service. That was the whole point of me coming early. So yeah, and this hat keeps trying to slip off. I'm gonna need this hat to stay with the aesthetic, okay? I have a few minutes to spare, so I'm just kind of like chilling. That's why I like to arrive to like, you know, um, things I have to do early 
so I'm not rushing. I have time to find where I need to go. I can finish my chai. I'm excited to meet everybody today and uh, take some flicks with y'all. Okay guys, so I decided to put the glasses on. Can y'all see me? I'm trying to find I'm trying to find good light. I can't tell if this light is good or not, especially because my frames are yellow. But this is the look that you guys voted for on you I'm not YouTube on Instagram. You guys voted for this outfit. So it's a two-piece set. I don't know if you guys can see it, but the top and the bottoms are actually a set that I got from Fashion Nova. The blazer jacket, you guys saw it in my Zara um try on haul. So this is from Zara. And then I got like look, we have the whole monochromatic vibe going on, okay? These slides are from Zara as well. The hat, the little beret is from ASOS, the glasses are from Forever 21. The earrings are Zara. And I just put a gloss on top of my Fenty lip paint. Um, I just put like a matte gloss. It's like iridescent, but I just I just didn't want to do a matte lip today. And I don't know if I showed you guys my nails. My hands stay ashy, so if they're ashy, don't judge me, girl. But that's that's the look. That's the look we got. Oh, let's see. You wanna say hi to my vlog? Hi. Say hi. How's it going? You wanna tell them oh what your name? God, it's okay! <laughs> Hi, I'm Isaiah with uh, AT&T at the BT Experience. Yes, girl. We're look so at the excited to have Jessica. Aw, yeah. look at her hair. Black, like, look at the okay, blue. yeah, I show and them all the of this. You see all of this. <laughs> I'm gonna give you, give you guys like a full on tour once I like go out and stuff. Yeah, we're about to do a media interview with AT&T PR. Ooh, interview. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right now. Yeah. Okay. Um, I mean, if you're ready, you saw the makeup artist. You, did you need a touch up or anything like that? Okay. That mirror actually will let me know. Okay, Can I go yeah, look. Take a look. <laughs> okay. On and where do I go? It's gonna be in this room um, right here. I think that. We're on... oh. oh yeah, that's actually we're gonna ask oh. if you were doing. Are you doing makeup? She's gonna um, do a PR interview right now on camera, camera, and I just want to see if she does need any like a yeah. powder, okay. like a touch up. Yeah. yeah. Well, she's in there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna. Yeah. Told me to come in here and see if I need a like a touch up. I think. No, you are good. I'm good. Yes. Okay. I mean, oh, this mirror though. Where'd you get her? Oh, I, said, I was like, she's beat. They were like, she needs right. makeup. I said, no, I, I don't think, think so. <laughs> I know. But she but can't be. So I'm, it's not I'm good. When you go up the yes. Place. Okay. Well, I'm leaving side. Was the side. <laughs> oh, Forever 21. <laughs> like four dollars. The beret. No, the glass is four dollars. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Oh, you know, you know, you know, I don't, I don't spend money. I know. Yeah, no, me neither. Okay. <laughs> she was like, I had an outfit yesterday, the whole weekend. It's all thrifted, and I was just like, that's thrifted too. I was like, yeah, I'll, that's all I do. I don't, I don't. Yes, buy that's how you, I, like I don't need to touch up my makeup. So that's a good thing. You don't do hair, but you would have like the edge. Aren't these glasses cute though, y'all? Yeah. Hey, let me stand right in front of the light. Yeah, I don't want to brush it that way. We're always trying to find the light. One, take one, marker. Okay, so today I'm super excited just to meet like people. <laughs> I'm so excited because when you're behind a screen or you're like an influencer, numbers don't actually in your brain connect to people until you actually go out there and meet them and get to talk to them, get to hug them and connect with them. So I think that's for me the most exciting part of doing what I do is to be able to meet people and they tell me how inspiring I've been to them. And just like that connection, that human interaction is what I look forward to the most today. <laughs> Daughter outfit of the day goals. I cannot wait to be a mom so I can do what she does. She is a mass 
over 200,000 YouTube followers and has worked with countless brands. Please welcome to the stage, Jessica Padway. <laughs> I just finished the BET experience. I had so much fun hanging out with AT&T. Um, so now it's time for me to go get some food because I'm hungry. Shout out to Instagram. You guys picked this outfit and this was a slaying look. I'm just saying. I got so many compliments on this look. Like everyone was like, girl, yes, slay. Remember when I got this magazine? Let's flip through these pages and see who's in it. Guys, look who's in Essence Magazine. How freaking dope is that? Like, for Jessica! And so if you get your 2018, I'm in the hair segment of Essence Magazine. This is the July issue. Get you a copy, there go. Janet Jackson's on the cover. And Jessica Petway in the magazine. Can't, like I can't. That is, that is me. Can I explain to you guys how cool this is? Not only, look at this, look at this. So I worked with Dr. Carey and we're sharing like all these different braid styles. Cause you know, a lot of times people feel like you could only do one look with braids. No, -uh, girl, look at this dope bomb, just dopeness. Okay. That we, that we did. Look at this. I'm like fangirling over myself. And there she is again. Okay, this is like, I can't. Growing up, nobody really knew how to do my hair. Like braids was like my go-to style. It was, it was the first style that I learned how to do on myself. So I would always like braid my hair. I would put individuals, put my hair in individuals and style it in different ways. Like I always had to be creative. And I think that's why I'm such a creative person because one, when you're poor, broke, and <laughs> you can't afford to get your hair done, a and um secondly when no one knows how to do your hair and to deal with your hair texture um it just inspired me to be more creative with my look i would literally like take my mom's like essence magazine or her hype hair magazine or her sophisticated black hair magazine take those magazines like i don't think she knew i would take them and then like i would take certain pages out and post them on my wall and that was like my inspiration just looking at all the different dope hairstyles just the different ways that a woman could look and you know style herself that always intrigued me even as like a child going from tearing those pages out of magazines and plastering them over my wall to actually being in one i don't know i just like for me it's just like i don't know i don't know how to describe that feeling but it's a good feeling and it it's also just like it's crazy in the same in the same breath because it's like how like 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 how how did i get how did I get here? I have a passion for being creative. I have a passion for just self-expression and style and being unique and all that stuff. And I feel like despite your numbers, despite whatever your, your upbringing is, where you grew up, the lack of resources or whatever, guys, literally your drive, passion, creativeness, and just your individuality, it will take you so many places.
guys, I'm going to end the vlog right here. I had so much fun at the BET experience with AT&T. Love meeting you guys. It was a lot of fun. I had so much fun today at BET experience with AT&T. I love meeting you guys. So I cannot wait for the next thing I'm getting myself into. Make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel and turn on your post notifications so you do not miss out on any more videos. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.